is our number one concern. That's why we ask you to take five minutes to get to know these important safety procedures. Then you can relax and really enjoy your cruise. Emergency procedures, safety procedures, and the mandatory safety drill comply with SOAS, the International Convention for Safety of Life at Sea. The only signal that requires you to act is the general emergency signal of seven short blasts and one long blast. This is not a signal to abandon ship. When you hear this signal, go straight to your assembly station. You'll find your assembly station on your cruise card and your cabin door. If you're traveling with children under 12, upon embarkation, will be there to give them an ID wristband. For their own safety, kids must keep their wristbands on at all times. Don't use the elevator in an emergency. If there's a power outage, you could be trapped. Please make your way to the assembly station quickly and quietly, so you can hear crew instructions. Walk, don't run. Guides are there to assist you, show them your cruise car so they can help, and always follow their directions. In stairways and hallways, keep to the right. If your kids are at a kids club, staff will take them to the children's pickup area. Find them there and go together to your assembly station. After you've presented your cruise card for the count, check your life jacket is securely fitted and that the whistle and the light are in good working order. Please keep quiet so you can hear any instructions. Your life jacket goes on over your head. Pull together the two front pieces. First, clasp the waist belt. Then, clasp the belt under your chin. Pull the free end to tighten. If your life jacket's too small, or if you weigh over 140 kilos, 308 pounds, you can ask for an extension belt. Always follow crew instructions. In the unlikely event that you need to abandon ship, survival craft are prepared by the ship's crew. Board the boat when asked to do so by the crew. Please watch your step when boarding, then sit down. When the boat's full, it will be lowered to the water. All passengers on this vessel are assigned a place on a lifeboat. And don't worry, there are extra survival craft and evacuation systems in place in case there's a malfunction. These will be inflated by the crew. Slide down one at a time, having first removed unsuitable shoes. Take to the water only as a last resort. If it is necessary, pinch your nose using the fingers of one hand. Place part of the same hand over your mouth. With your other arm, grip your shoulder to stop your life jacket from riding up. All safety information is found on the back of your cabin door. If you're hard of hearing or have mobility problems and you need help getting to the assembly station, let staff know beforehand at reception guest service. Extension 99. They'll make sure you have everything you need in an emergency. Fire safety. Fire safety is extremely important at sea. Smoke only in designated areas. Smoking in bed and on cabin balconies is strictly prohibited. Never throw lit cigarettes, cigars, or matches over the ship's side. They may blow back onto the ship and cause a fire. smell smoke or see a fire, activate a red fire alarm button found around the ship and alert a crew member or officers manning the bridge. The crew will take immediate action. All our crew members are regularly drilled in fire safety. The fire emergency signal is two long blasts. This signal alerts emergency crew members and doesn't directly affect passengers. In the event of a fire or other emergency, fire doors close automatically. They're heavy, but can be opened by hand. Low lighting along the hall will guide you to safety. If you encounter smoke, stay close to the deck where the air is clearest. Man overboard. If you see someone fall overboard, throw them a life buoy. Keep them in view at all times. Shout man overboard and specify whether they're on the left or right side of the ship when facing forward. Keep shouting until a crew member is notified. 
than an overboard signal is three lung blasts. Prevention of accidents. Help us prevent accidents by taking care and holding on when moving around the ship in rough weather. Use caution on wet decks. Never sit or play on side rails or allow children to sit on them, even if you're holding on to them. This is highly dangerous. Onboard security. Please don't bring anything on board on behalf of a stranger. Staff will check your cruise card when boarding or leaving the ship. Please be aware that anyone boarding the ship may be screened or searched for the possession of weapons, explosives, incendiaries or other prohibited items. Certain areas of the ship are restricted. Please respect these areas at all times. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this safety video. Please familiarize yourself with safety procedures on the back of your cabin door and memorize the emergency drill procedure. You will be reassured you know what to do in case of an emergency. On behalf of the captain, officers, staff and crew of MSC, we wish you a safe and happy cruise.